Hi, and welcome back to Games Overboard. This is Brian. I'm here with Stefan from Asimoto Games Editions, and he's got a brand new game he wants to talk to us about called Claustrophobia. Um, you were saying earlier this is kind of a dungeon crawl, kind of a descent meets dungeon twister kind of game? Yeah, it's the same, the same way, two players only. Uh, what we have to do is play one or two player demons. Humans are trying to uh, do its operation, so it's a scenario, it's a scenario game. So we are trying to, uh, try to survive in that game. But demon players is trying to annihilate them with all the tokens. Uh, we start with like three, four players, uh, characters, mm -hmm. and the demon always send more and more and more against us. So, it's trying to survive. Uh, there's a little bit of luck uh, with the dice, but it's not that much about it. Uh, the biggest thing about it is if, you, uh, if you're trying to, to cheat the rules to, uh, to try to avoid the, the, the luck, uh, you will be penalized. So. Yeah, um, so the, the, looking at the tiles here, they're, they're absolutely gorgeous pieces, but it looks like we build the board kind of as we play. So you really never know exactly what the board's going to be like? Each game will be completely different. Uh, the fun thing about it is always to uh, try to make new games. Uh, with the website, it's always uh, scenarios. Uh, at the beginning, we've got six scenarios. But after that, you can uh, imagine whatever you want. Okay. So do the scenarios tell you exactly how to build the board? Or at the beginning, yes. Okay, at the very beginning, but then it's kind of left open to you to kind of make your own and kind of create your own create your own adventure as it were. Um, kind of like I mean, when I look at the boards, it looks a lot like um, like Saboteur and Trailer House and how other really good like, games like that where it's kind of a creepy scenario, things are walking through, it's these pieces and the components are absolutely great, all of your miniatures come painted, um, the little holders for the dice of the player boards are absolutely great. So yeah, we're looking forward to checking it out. Um, as Modi Games, uh, any other good releases or anything like that? Suggestions you want to tell people about? Uh, Mr. Jack and Moyer, uh, if you like it a bit tougher than the older, Mr. Jack and This version just came out uh, a month ago. Great. And, uh, I really, really like it because it's a little bit tougher, a little bit harder than the, uh, the old version. Mm -hmm. So it's a little bit under me. Yeah, it's great. You guys, they also do some of my favorite games we've done with you in the past of Jungle Speed, one of our favorite games of all time, um, The Last Ride. So I like that you guys do, you know, some people kind of get stuck in one genre. You guys do some darker games, some more heavy yeah. games. They also do lighter games, Formula B, the reprint of the old popular Formula Day, or the reimagining of it, rather, um, is by you guys also, and it's a great game. Um, yeah, check out his movie games. This is Stephanie. I'm Brian, and we'll see you next time for another edition of Games Overboard.